So yesterday I was feeling depressed, lonely, like shit. Straight up woke up, I was just laying in bed, and I just thought to myself, Man, I really feel like a fucking turd, dude. But naturally, after feeling like a piece of shit, dude, I did what any rational human being would do in this situation, which is go to YouTube and find the best positive vibe YouTuber imaginable. You know, the ones that really just cheer you up, dude. And of course I'm talking about the comedic genius, Nicole fucking arbor dude y'all are just mad i told the truth true, true. please think i'm funny this is all i got my life is fucking ruined everybody hates me my husband divorced me my little kid stabbed me in the pussy this is all i got dude please think i'm funny but ever since my last video on nicole arbor everybody has been telling me that i need to make one last video on the queen of positive vibes Nicole Harper. So today I looked at some of her videos and I saw the most offensive video ever. I mean, holy shit, the title says it all. I mean, all I gotta say is who's ready to get fucking offended because I sure am, dude. I love getting offended. That's just my favorite thing of all time, man. But without further ado, we're gonna be playing this fantastic video. Everybody sit back, relax, grab some popcorn, grab some of your uh, p positive butthole plugs, and let's play this shit. Pup, 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 play that shit, dude. A retarded midget walks into the bar. And it's okay, because it's 1992. <laughs> midget, get it, guys? <laughs> hey, that's not politically correct. <laughs> oh, oh my god, it's so funny, dude! Hilarious. Nicole Arbor, seriously, drop this YouTube shit. I mean, YouTube is for people that think they're funny, like myself, right? Like, I think I'm funny, but I'm really just like a cyber bully cunthole dickwad, right? You, though, you're actually funny. You need to go on Comedy Central, take off these diapers of YouTube, and just go straight to Comedy Central. I mean, you. You're talented, dude. We're all trying to be politically correct so that we don't offend anyone. I don't care if you're offended. If you don't have a sense of humor and you don't understand jokes, I don't give a fuck. If you don't think I'm funny, I don't give a fuck. If you're fucking fat, I don't give a fuck. You know, anyone that constantly needs to bring up that they don't give a fuck, I'm gonna let you guys in on a little secret. They do give a fuck. They give a big fuck. Like, what she's doing right now is just like a teenage boy with highlights in his hair saying, I don't care! I don't fucking care if you like me! Or like someone they just went through a breakup that's like, I, I don't really care, you know, like, fuck that bitch, dude. I mean, I don't really care. Okay, we all know you guys care, okay? If you don't have a sense of humor and you don't understand jokes, I don't give a fuck. Like, you can even see the anger in her fucking face. She obviously cares, dude! She looks like a fucking character off The Walking Dead that's been surviving in the woods for multiple days and she just keeps repeating the same shit. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. I don't give a fuck. To quote my favorite color M&M, the white one, you find me offensive. Well, I find you offensive for finding me offensive. Get it, guys? Because I'm pretending to be racist. <laughs> I don't know why, but Nicole Arbor reminds me of uh, fucking Skeletor. You know, from He-Man? That motherfucker right there? That's fucking Nicole Arbor, dude. That's straight up her. Fucking Skeletor looking ass. Me Offensive. Keyboard warriors are trying to murder comedy. You need to learn that we all don't need to fucking care about your feelings. Okay, I agree that the keyboard warriors are very annoying. Like, straight up, people that type shit like, Oh, you can't joke around about that. That's offensive. My teacher said it was bad. Like having a fucking stroke from a YouTube video. Like, okay, really, dude? But like, I don't think they're trying to murder comedy, dude. Like, goddamn. Like, Nicole, just because someone doesn't think you're funny doesn't mean they're trying to murder the fucking comedic values of life. We all don't need to fucking care about your feelings. I'm glad that you're trying to kill comedy because it makes the bloodbath of fucking awesome I'm bringing self-motherfucking defense, yo. <laughs> Ugh, what the fuck, dude? This is not funny at all. This is giving me fucking AIDS, dude. This is not funny at all. You try to attack me, it makes itself defense. How, how is that funny, dude? Does anybody here actually think it's funny? And if you do think it's funny, well, guess what, dude? Then you, you're killing my comedic values. You're killing comedy on my channel. How does it make you feel, dude? Not good, huh? Well, that's right. I learned that from Nicole Arbor, man. That's yo. Everything's really offensive. Bitch, you trying to kill comedy? I'ma kill you first. Oops, sorry. I learned that from black people in movies. Dude, she's trying so hard to be edgy and funny, and it's just, it's, it's shit. It is shit, man. Like, I wonder if her thought process behind this video and the Dear Fat People video was, well, like, everybody naturally hates me, and I'm not funny, but, 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 well, maybe if I'm just, like, really offensive, and I get everybody to hate me, there might be, like, 5% of people that, 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 that think I'm hilarious. This is fail-proof. Offensive. You wanna know what's offensive? 
rat tails. I can't believe those were ever a thing. We just want to make sure everyone knows Johnny's from a low income family. People starving in a country with more than enough food. If you don't know what a rat tail is, it's a piece of hair at the back like near the nape, that you let grow long, and sometimes you braid it. It usually means you live in a trailer, or your parents beat each other in front of you. Oh my god, dude. For a second there, I actually thought the rat tail shit wasn't that bad. It wasn't too bad, okay? But then she just decides to ruin it with one of these. Let me just, let me just push my hands together. Oh, they're having sex. Uh, what the fuck? Like, dude, imagine if every single time I said something, I just had to follow it up with one of these. <laughs> Wow, that was hilarious. Childhood obesity, that is offensive. There's no reason for a little kid to be a freaking chubby chub chub. Is Nicole fucking retarded? I'm not trying to be a dick or an asshole, but... Is this bitch actually fucking retarded? Like, okay, I get it. Some people can do the little, oh, ha, 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 they're having sex. It's funny. But, like, she's been doing it for, like, four minutes now. Like, I, I, I don't even know what to say. What the fuck, Nicole? Maybe she forgot to take her pills. I mean, I have no idea, dude. Throwing their cards in the air like it's a Pokemon tournament at the Parkinson's hospital. I didn't mean to do that. My kids will live in a world where people can use stereotypes for funny jokes. Your kids are probably gonna get bullied because you're their mom. Straight up kids are gonna be like, Hey Billy, is that your fucking mom over there? What the fuck is she doing, dude? What? Oh yeah, th that's my mom. She's she's doing like some YouTube skit. She's not really funny, but man, I really don't want to talk about it. Can we can we just play video games? Well, Billy, she's definitely not funny, and she might be handicapped. But I can tell you one thing: I would definitely super soak that hoe. Damn those tits, guys! Can we please just play video games? Damn it, dude! I have to use this again. You know how when you like jump into the comment sections and think you're starting? Uh, yeah, I'm fucking. You're doing nothing, nothing for the world, nothing, nothing. Also, I talked about this in the last video, but what in the actual fuck is this music? It's like army music. Like, it's in all of her videos, and I don't know what pisses me off more. Her, the video, or the music. I, I take it all back, dude. It's definitely the music. I can't stand this shit. Everybody's worried about terrorism, but keyboard warriors are the new terrorists. Keyboard warriors are the new terrorists, dude. Nicole Arbor. 2016. Don't forget to like, favorite, subscribe, and donate to our new cause. Hashtag keyboard warriors equal uh, terrorists. Uh, one like equal no terrorism. This has been your message from uh, Nicole Arbor Studios. Yeah, dude. If my future kid turns out gay, that's fine. Transgender, sure. But if they're one of those little assholes who type rude comments on other people's videos, disown. Oh my god, guys, she would have disowned us. We would have got disowned by Nicole. It's okay, everybody. It's okay, dude. I wouldn't have disowned you, man. I, I, I would have took you in underneath the rain. And, and I, I would have I would have raised you myself, dude. And we would have had a happy life, dude, okay? Just just know that in your heart. I'm there for you, dude. I... <laughs> I, I love you guys. Because an entire generation that's scared to make jokes is a generation of pussies. And not the nice kind. Thanks for watching everybody. My name is Nicole Arbor. Yeah, yeah. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Yeah, if you didn't like this video, I don't fucking care. If you didn't like this video, I don't fucking care. I do care. Please like my videos, think I'm funny, spank my butthole. Well guys, in conclusion today, it doesn't matter what we say to Nicole Arbor because she doesn't care, dude. It doesn't matter what happens, she doesn't care. And I mean, you just gotta give her some props for that, dude. She has some hardcore straight bravery, dude. She goes on the internet, she gets roasted, but she doesn't care. Like when I make videos and someone comments saying that I look like a fucking napkin, that pisses me off, dude. It, it, it drives me crazy. I can't control my myself i reply back with kill yourself and i just feel like we all have to give her respect for that bravery respect nicole <laughs> but i hope you guys enjoyed this video today and wait wait trump what we're doing a giveaway today are you serious 
Holy shit, man. Today, if you like this video, you will be receiving a small billion loans of one million dollars. This is no joke at all. Trump, are you sure about this? One billion fucking loans, dude. Are you sure? Well, Trump said it himself. One billion loans of one million dollars. If you just like this video today, this is not a scam. This is coming directly from Trump. So the choice is yours, dude. But jokes aside, thank you so much for all the support and thank you for watching. And I hope you guys have a fantastic day. You guys are, uh, pretty cool, dude. <laughs> See ya. But, but, but Nicole Arbor is hilarious. Kill yourself, Leafy.